YouTube. Um, this is Jenny. I just thought I'd do another another video uh, update. I am two weeks out uh, yesterday of my VSG surgery um, that I had done in Mexico uh, with Dr. Almanza. Um, I am now down uh, 25 pounds since I started this. Uh, that's including my uh, pre-op diet. I um, am doing very well. The only thing um, that I've had any issues over was just my incision sites. Um, struggled to get uh, the uh, sutures out. Um, luckily I work for a wonderful dentist and she was able to get the rest of them out for me as well as my sister. Um, they've been slow for he healing for me. Uh, my sisters are healing better than mine. Um, a little what I thought was kind of pussy or there's just got this white kind of stuff with in them and they're just kind of ugly. Um, but I think they're finally getting better. They say don't put any antibiotic cream on them. However, I did. Um, after the sutures came out, I just felt like they needed something on them. Um, so anyway, uh, what am I eating? Uh, I have had absolutely zero nausea, zero vomiting. Um, I can definitely tell when I've had enough. I, uh, you can feel it all the way in here, like, okay, that's it. I'm not going to take another bite. Um, I've, uh, I try to get all my protein in and it's nearly impossible. Um, I, I drink those protein shakes that have 25 grams of protein in them. Um, uh, I'm able to get in an entire Chobani yogurt. That's new for me. I did that today. It took me about an hour to get, and those have like four, 13 or 14 protein grams in them. Uh, last night I mashed up some potatoes and I cut up some chicken and um, I, I put it in my puree thing and uh, I could probably only get a couple spoonfuls in. Um, I'm, I really noticed a difference between the thicker consistency versus the puddings and yogurts. Those tend to really go down a lot more easily for me. Um, not that I get sick or anything, I just get that real full feeling in my stomach like, okay, I can't do any more of that. Um, so I'm going to try it again tonight, uh, the same little bowl that I had, only I'm going to make it runnier with some potato. Because I'm at day 15 now and I think we're allowed to have mashed potatoes, um, we're allowed the, the baby food consistency, meats and things like that. Uh, baby food itself I don't want to try so that's why I've opted to just make my own in my own little puree machine so so that's what I'm doing um, I uh, I've tried cottage cheese that's okay you know I've tried some scrambled eggs a little harder to get down so you it's easier to get your protein in liquid form for me than to get it in uh, the food I eat because food fills you up and the liquid you can get more in. So I'm still taking my protein shakes, um, which have 25, then the yogurt had another 13, and then I've been putting the unflavored protein powder in soup, um, all different types of cream soups, and that tastes really well. Uh, my sister put a protein powder today in her Crystal Light, and she said it was awful. Um, not that it had a taste so much, but it was the milky consistency that she says she couldn't, she couldn't drink it. Um, I'm probably not doing as well as she is as far as my fluids go, but I'm probably doing better than she is as far as my um, protein goes. I take two Flintstone chewables a day. Um, with they're the Flintstone complete. I take five 1,000 mcg of biotin, so that's 5,000. 
I take um, one zinc, um, it's a chewable zinc, and one B12. And they're all chewable, and I'm good with all of that. You know, I'm able to take, I still take blood pressure medicine, so I'm able to take that in the evening without a problem. So um, I'm feeling pretty good. I, uh, I'm soon going to be below 200. I'm now 202. So uh, started out 227, so I'm feeling really good. Um, if I could just get these incisions to heal. I mean, I mean, you can see I'm getting it all over my... This one is still looking pretty raw. And these I have covered just because they're still kind of raw. Now, my sister isn't... isn't um, she doesn't have anything on hers, covering hers. But I feel I still need to. So, so that's it. This is my two-week update. And that's it for today. And I'll update you again maybe in another week or so. Okay, thanks for watching.